Hi guys, good afternoon. Uh, it's already 5.27pm uh, and uh, most likely pauwi na yung iba sa atin sa trabaho and uh, yung iba naman eh, magsisimula na rin magsara ng kanilang mga negosyo and I'm gonna be closing shop at uh, 6pm later so malapit na pero before I call it a day eh, naisip ko na i-share sa inyo The last time I had uh, spoken at Adventist University of the Philippines to talk about PRIDE. PRIDE is actually an acronym that stands for Personal Responsibility in uh, Developing or Driving Excellence. And uh, naisip ko na malamang magbe-benefit din po kayo kapag sinare ko sa inyo yung mga bagay na sinare ko doon. Ano? Well, one of the highlights of uh, my three-hour speech back then was yung sinare ko sa kanila yung how do we embody excellence so nagbigay ako ng mga tips o ng mga best practices na in-apply ko rin dati at in-apply ko pa rin hanggang ngayon kung paano of course we can uh, assure excellence in us and yun yung i-discuss natin in 5 to 10 minutes so magiging mabilis lang po to and make sure that you have something to write on and if you have a photographic memory okay lang kapag sa doing mo lang din um, first tip ko siguro isa sa mga worries or challenges natin, ano, mapa may trabaho man tayo, mapa may negosyo man tayo, bakit kaya hindi tayo ma-promote-promote? Well, bakit kaya hindi tayo nag-excel or nagiging successful sa mga products or services na binibenta natin? Uh, one of the things na nasinare noon ay, you know what, when you have a creative idea, or when, a, when a creative idea pops up, okay, I recommend that you you write it down, right? You put it in writing, you document it, you execute it right away or immediately. Okay, and then you just critique it all along or while you are working on it, while you are on it, okay, during the process. May ilang kasi sa atin, meron tayo idea and uh, we believe na boy, you know, this is really creative, this is really innovative, that this is really gonna work. Napapangunahan tayo ng mga iba't ibang klase ng fear, eh. yung fear na, bawa kapag tayo empleyado, fear na this is gonna be rejected by our boss that it's going to be criticized, that it's not going to be acknowledged. So, yun eh, yun yung isa sa mga reasons kung ba't may mga creative idea tayo na hindi natin na-implement, na hindi natin na-apply, na hindi natin na-share, na hindi natin, kumbaga, we're not able to read life into it. So, kailangan alisin natin yung uh, mentalidad na what if, what if, what if. What if my boss doesn't acknowledge it? What if my boss doesn't, you know, uh, apply it what if the boss just keeps it lost in the pipeline or stuck in the pipeline so yun yung mga worries natin diba so we have to overcome such fears and uh, challenges in our mentality so when we have a creative idea once again document it execute it right away and just critique it all along kasi ba mamaya at the very end magsisi ka all right So don't let other people make the first move to try that idea, that innovation, all right, that could have been yours, all right. So that's the first tip I share ko sa inyo on how to uh, embody excellence. Pangalawa po, siguro in line din to eh, dito sa when you have a creative idea, lahat ng bagay, alam mo lahat tayo, we, we were created equally. Lahat po tayo para sa akin, this is just my opinion, but I do believe that every one of us, okay, is uh, smart, wise, intelligent. So, pag meron kang, in line with the tip that I shared just earlier, if you have an idea, ito lagi ang isipin mo. If you can think it, you can believe it. And because you can believe it, you can do it. And because you can do it, you can achieve it. And if you, and because you can achieve it, then you can always welcome a better life. So, ganun yun. So, ibig sabihin, Whatever the mind conceives, the body achieves. If you will just apply in your life the law of attraction, okay, na lahat ng iniisip mo, magkakatotoo ito, no? Lahat ng i-attract ko papunta sa akin, makakamit ko yan, mangyayari yan sa akin, then that's really what's gonna happen. That's how powerful our mind is. Okay, once again, ulitin ko lang sa inyo yun, ha? If you can think it, you can believe it. And because you can believe it, you can do it. And because you can do it, you can achieve it. And because you can achieve it, well, start welcoming a better life. Alright? So, yun po ang pangalawang tip na i-share ko sa inyo. And, uh, ang pangatlong tip naman, alam mo, kung if you want to be successful in life, if you want to, you know, go up the corporate ladder very fast, isa sa mga bagay na dapat lagi mong ginagawa. Because, alam mo, excellence is not just an act. 
It's not just a one, two, three times act. It's a habit. So if this is something you do every single day, then it's not impossible that you would achieve success in your life. That you would be promoted very fast. As a matter of fact, you're going to be promoted several times, okay? There is no other way but upwards. It is going the extra mile, going above and beyond the call of duty. Because, you know, this is what I always share with other people. What makes us special, okay, is not what we do, that we really have to do. Let's say, kapag empleyado ka, you really have to do it because that's what you are being paid to do, okay? Or sa negosyo mo, kailangan mong gawin nyo. Otherwise, kapag di mo ginawa yun, is magko-close ka agad, no? Mabankrupt, uh, bankrupt ka agad. So, of course, uh, gawin mo, all right, let, let me repeat it, ha? what makes us special is not what we do, that we have to do, but what we still do, even though we don't have to do it. All right? What we ought to do, that uh, we don't have to do to begin with, but we're still doing anyways. Even though there's nothing in return that we're gonna, you know, benefit from, we still do anyways. That exact, that's exactly what going the extra mile is, okay? So, yan pa. Ang sunod na showcase sa buhay mo is uh, before you can earn other people's trust, respect, you, you gotta trust and respect yourself first, okay? So, always remember this, guys. Take pride in who you are and what you do, okay? And other people from whom you expect the same thing will definitely look up to you as well, all right? So, kung inaasahan mo ang ibang tao, of course, na uh, purihin ka, na tingalain ka, na will be able to follow in your footsteps, kailangan, you gotta role model, okay? What positive actions are. You gotta role model excellence. So, it has to start within you. It has to start within you and then towards other people, okay? So you don't get about nothing paying back or paying forward. So yeah, take pride in what you do and who you are and other people, okay, will also take pride in who you are and what you do. And uh, of course, more especially, they're going to take pride in who they are and what they do, all right? So hopefully you were able to uh, understand that. No, medyo mataling haga, pero ganun po talaga yun. Itindihin mo na lang. Okay, so susunod guys. Ito, bakit kaya, uh, of course, uh, uh, don't get me wrong, it's not that I'm saying na life's about competition. No? Pero syempre, the reality is whether you're in a business or you are an employee, there's really a competition. You, you couldn't really avoid it. Pero bakit kaya, there are some people who always, uh, you know, stand out. They always end at the very top. They always end the best in what they do. They're, they always end at the very top. Bakit kaya? Kasi alam mo, one of the reasons that uh, or one of uh, your weapons will help you really uh, compete with the best out there is this. Tandaan mo ito. Do not compete with the competition. Let or make the competition compete with you. Ano ibig sabihin nyo? Ano natin patalinghaga na naman, Myron? What that means is, alam mo, hindi mo na kailangan makipag-compete sa competition mo. Sila makikipag-compete sa'yo. Kasi ang sinasabi mo, ang pinapakita mo, ang ginagawa mo, yung mga bagay na meron ka, no? They're unique, meaning they're what, you know, uh, set you apart from the competition out there. You are doing that others are not doing. You are, or how you are doing what you are doing is definitely something uh, different, something unique, something innovative, something creative. Na talagang, it's really very hard for people who, who, who give or who deliver the same line of business or product or services na mapagtayaan ka ka sa teka. Uh, once again, I'm not bragging, but if I may just share my brand of corporate entertainment, when I train, I entertain people. I make sure that when they step out of the room at the end of my speaking engagement or my uh, training engagement, that uh, they can confidently tell themselves, wow, I learned from that person and I enjoyed. I, I left all the time. I, I, I would be leaving this room with a smile on my face. You know, that person has a great sense of humor, etc. See, don't compete with the competition. Make or let the competition compete with you. Okay? There you have it. And ano pa ba mga bagay na isi-share ko to? Ah, ito. Ito yung uh, napakaganda. Siguro this is gonna be the last for today. Siguro tomorrow we're gonna, we're gonna continue with the other half. Si medyo madami-dami ito. Ang last na tip na i-share ko sa inyo, so you can embody excellence, so you can be successful in 
Well, in, in whatever you do, anywhere you go, be it in business or be it in the corporate world, guys, okay, who you are and what you can do today should always be a better version of who you are and what you could do yesterday, the other day, you know, a month ago, a year back, all right? This means, in short, that be a better version of yourself yesterday. In other words, you should always, what, make a sincere effort to improve yourself every single day. And if you're able to do that, then of course, walang ibang daan kundi pataas, okay? Like myself, guys, there's always a room for improvement. I'm only in my 30s, very early 30s. So it doesn't mean that the learning already stops. I continue to learn. I continue to improve my craft. I continue to hone my skills. I continue to develop inside. I, I continue to enhance you know, my communication skills. I continue to you know, read books, uh, watch educational or very informative material to help me. You know, always better myself uh, every day. So, sana ganon din kayo. Because if that's how you do it, then, syempre, magiging successful talaga kayo and excellence ako anumang gagawin nyo. Okay? So, there you have it. Hopefully, you were able to note down everything that we discussed here. Gawin mo lang itong mga bagay na ito. And meron pa tayong mga pag-uusapan siguro bukas if uh, we have time. And definitely, okay, you're gonna be well on your way to success, kaibigan. So, kaibigan, Ingat ka saan ka man papunta, kung pauwi, or may dadaanan ka pa. And hopefully, nakatulong ako sa araw mo ngayon. This is uh, Mr. Myron Santana, your corporate entertainer, wishing you that you enjoy the rest of your